Hi guys and welcome to the family fudge. Today I have a fill in style grocery haul to share with you. We ended up going to Costco, to Trader Joe's, and to Walmart and we tried to focus on healthier foods this time. So stay tuned and I will show you what we got. Okay friends, so I'm gonna jump right in and show you the things from Costco first, starting with our one non-food item. I got this double pack of wall-mounted hooks, and these are great for organizing coats and hats and scarves and things like that. Now this double pack also came in a brown color, but I really like the white. Now this double pack was only $14.99, and pretty much the same thing at Walmart is gonna cost you $24.99. So this is a really good deal at Costco right now. We also got a double pack of the Honey Bunches of Oats. The kids tried this for the first time last time and they really liked it. So I definitely wanted to get another box while it was still on sale. We also stocked up on milk, of course, <laughs> for the cereal and other things. This is a double pack of 2% milk. And then we got lots of fruits and veggies, starting with a big bag of broccoli florets. We also got some baby spinach, some Mediterranean salad, and my favorite, the sweet kale salad. We also got a big bag of lemons to make some lemon water in the mornings. We also got a big thing of yogurt for the kids and lots of frozen fruit. This is mostly for smoothies. This one has mango, strawberries, pineapples, and peaches. And this one is the blackberry, strawberry, and blueberry one. I like both of these, I like to alternate. We also picked up two tubs of protein powder. This green one is actually a chocolate one, and the blue one is vanilla. I've never tried the vanilla, but I like the chocolate. Costco has a really good price on these. Moving back over here to the front, we got some cherry tomatoes, some asparagus, and a huge bag of baby carrots. Now this whole bag was only like $4, and I'm hoping we can get through the whole bag before they go bad. I also picked up some cucumbers, some cottage cheese, and a triple pack of the organic ground beef. This is going into some recipes this week and probably next week as well. We also got another carton of eggs this week. We've been going through eggs like crazy. So we got this 24 pack of organic eggs and a double pack of this multi-grain bread. This has oats and seeds on it, it's pretty good. And one of these loaves will go directly into the freezer. My husband put these in the cart. These are extra fancy unsalted nuts. He likes to snack on those. We also got a big, huge bag of sweet potatoes and some avocados. Now I think that's everything from Costco. So I'll go ahead and show you the few things we got from Trader Joe's. Not too much this time. Starting back here, I have a package of the veggie sticks. These are really tasty and perfect to put into lunches. We also got some of this light kettle corn. This light kettle corn is perfect if you're looking for a sweet snack that is not too bad for you. We also got the kids favorite, this mandarin orange chicken. Definitely going to be an easy dinner for them one night this week. And then we got these guys. This is a bottle of coconut aminos. So this is, this is a lot like soy sauce, but it's soy free and gluten free. But it's a great way to flavor your food and it's a good alternative to regular soy sauce. I also got some of this green goddess salad dressing. This is avocados, green onion, lemon juice, chives, basil, and garlic. It has such a good fresh flavor. I love this stuff. 
And then a bottle of kombucha. I actually got two, but my husband and I split one on the way home. Now I also got something new this time. This is a gluten-free, vegan, just add water falafel mix. Now I am a big fan of falafels. I'm not sure this is gonna go in my diet plan this week, but it looks delicious. Next to that, I picked up a container of chicken stock. This is a really good price at Trader Joe's and I just needed one box, so I picked that up. We also got some quick cooking brown basmati rice and some white quinoa. Now moving on over to the things I got from Walmart. I got another bag of these sweet potato fries. These are so tasty and really quick for dinner. We got a bag of the Italian style frozen meatballs, one loaf of bread, one thing of burger buns, and hot dog buns. And this is something new we're trying for the first time. This is wow butter. This is peanut free peanut butter. <laughs> I know that sounds funny, but we've tried sun butter before and we really didn't like it. But sometimes I need to send the kids with a nut free lunch, so we're gonna give this a try. Over here we got some really fun mac and cheese. Of course, this is the Star Wars kind. There's all kinds of characters in there. That's gonna be really fun. Back here we got a bag of Granny Smith apples. We got a box of cornflakes and then some really fun things for lunches. We got some gigantic candy eyeballs and I got some of these food writer pens. Now I know not everyone's into food coloring but I thought I would give these a try anyway. We also got two cans of these SpaghettiOs. Some of my kids like SpaghettiOs and some don't so we shall see how it goes but I wanted to give these a try because they're these Star Wars ones. Those look really fun. Okay friends, that is everything in our haul today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.